The Consumer Council received more than 1,000 complaints related to airline tickets and services over the first eight months of the year. Some of the complainants said they were forced to check in their luggage despite their baggage having met carry-on requirements. Timothy Lee reports. Varieties and options for flight tickets are growing by the day, with many paying extra they want to bring more luggage or pre-select their seats. But the process may sometimes result in pre-flight frustration. This as the Consumer Council received 1,057 related complaints in the first eight months of this year, a 17 percent decrease compared with the same period last year. 42 percent of such cases involved budget airlines. Consumer Council Chief Executive Julie Wong said many airlines have canceled flights suddenly in recent times, ruining the travel plans of travelers. She added that many consumers will think airlines are taking advantage of them if communication between the two parties does not improve. In one such case, a complainant who paid $1,040 for a window seat was notified that the arrangement was not possible while checking in for their return flight. Another complainant said they purchased tickets that included the carry-on option for a 70-kilogram item, but was asked to check in the luggage at the airport gate. The airline apologized for the inconvenience but did not provide a refund. This, as the Consumer Council suggested relevant sectors improve their policies and services and handle such situations in a humane manner. Timothy Lee, TVB News.